Good morning, my beautiful people. Beautiful lie here once again. Just sitting out on my little break this morning. I already went into class today. We had our Victorian presentation, and that was that was entertaining. I guess I did like most of the work, so I'm not gonna lie. I just kind of kind of made my other group members present because you know I figured they they might as well. So Kimmy's gonna go ahead and present next. She's just sitting here with me, hanging out and. Just doing our thing this morning. She's got the 80s era, so she's going to be doing Footloose and fun stuff like that. So. Time of Our Lives by Dirty Dancing. So I'll be recording that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see ya. Kimmy's little group presentation was fun. She literally just stood there and danced the whole time while they kind of talked about it. It was entertaining. And then afterwards, we just watched The Great Gatsby, and I'm actually leaving about 10 minutes early for lunch so I can run over to Cosmo Prof and get my hair color so I can get my hair retouched for our practical unit today because we have a free day. So I get to get my hair colored and just be all girly. So we're going to go ahead, head over to Cosmo Prof, and then go home, um, get out of of my Victorian wear so I don't feel like a, a teacher anymore because honestly I feel like a teacher and it feels weird so we're gonna get out of my clothes and eat something so in case anybody is wondering where I'm gonna get my color and stuff this is Cosmo Prop. it is literally a store for cosmetologists and you have to have a license to buy anything here or a student card and um, this is a color that I get it's by Joyco color intensity semi-permanent indigo so now it's time to head home and get some food. Alright, so this is my Victorian look. Um, something that to kind of consider with the Victorian era. In the beginning they did a lot of hoop skirts, so their skirts would be out to here. And the hairstyle would match, so they would often do wings and like little rolls up to the side. But as time continued on, they got rid of the hoop skirt and did a bustle. And because they wanted to incorporate the woman's silhouette in every picture that they took, the hair began to change and was more voluminous towards the back. So in came the chignon. So this is my Victorian look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Now if you don't remind me, I'm going to remove my rump and get into some regular clothes. <laughs> Back in my regular clothes again. Well, not my regular clothes. My school clothes, once again. I was going to take down my hair, but honestly, I don't have the patience for that. So whoever does it can deal with it. <laughs> I love you! <laughs> Anyways, lunch was really good. I was quite hungry, so I enjoyed my peanut butter sandwich. Now, off to class to get my hair done. It's our school mania during our class day today. Just kind of working on each other, Hi. giving haircuts, stuff like that. Alright, so I am processing right now. I'm just lightening up my hair so I can go ahead and get my actual hair color here. Hang on, walking through the break room. Gonna head outside and sit in the sun. It'll help this lift a little better, get it lighter, and have myself a cigarette. And then we're gonna go back in, rinse it out, and throw on my hair color and a deep conditioner treatment. So. That is my plan for right now, and let me tell you, I'm all excited to see how this turns out. So, we'll keep you guys updated. Well, that was somewhat of a success. We went ahead and we um, lightened it, and we got the olive oil treatment. But as you can tell, my hair is still incredibly greasy from the olive oil treatment. So I was too afraid to add the hair color with, into it, with it being this full of stuff. So, I'm going to run home, get in the shower, hopefully get the rest of this washed out, and do the rest of my color.
right, so for the next two hours or so, my nickname shall be Bag Lady. Um, in all honesty, any color, um, demi permanent color stops process any color for that matter stops processing after so long. Um, personally, I like to just leave my color on for as long as I can stand it. I've come to find that the longer it stays in, the more vibrant of a color that I get and the better it comes out. So, since I got nothing to better do, might as well just sit, bake, and probably play Imperion. to rinse it out and get it dried and stuff, but I would say it's a success. My hair finally turned out the color that it's supposed to be. Just hanging out with Bandit and the kiddies right now, watching American History X. It's on Netflix if you haven't seen it. It's a pretty good movie. Um, it's honestly for a more mature audience, just so you guys are aware um, about white supremacy and stuff like that. It's really entertaining. Um, we're going to have some steaks for dinner and mashed potatoes, and I think that's about it for tonight. Probably going to kick back and watch some Family Guy be mauled by all my cats here. Batman says hi, too. <laughs> um, that's it for this vlog. If you liked it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, and please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Um, I definitely appreciate the support. So, Until the next one, guys.